Yes. And look what we've done. We've, we've gone beyond the solar system with Voyager. We've walked on the moon. Um, we've, we're, we're about to go to Mars, I would think. So we're about to begin colonising our own solar system. So we've done that in 500 years. So yeah. imagine a million years right. in the future. So I would... It's one of the arguments often used to say there aren't any civilizations out there in the galaxy. It's called the Fermi Paradox. Because if you imagine a civilization that's a million years ahead of us, they should have written their presence across the sky by now. They should, you should see them. Hmm. I mean, you'll see us. If we survive a million years into the future, actually even a few thousand years into the future, we will be exploring the galaxy. We will have spacecraft that are going to other stars. We will be doing it. So our signature will become visible, I'm sure. If you look at the surface of the moon, for example, it's covered in craters. And that was caused, they all seem to hit about the same time. And it's about 3.8 billion years ago or so. And that's called the late heavy bombardment. So we know that if you look at cratering rates on Mars and on the moon, it all seemed to happen in this, not all, but a big peak around that time. And that seems to be correlated with Neptune moving out mm. in the solar system and into the Kuiper Belt, basically, or towards the Kuiper Belt and causing all sorts of havoc and everything comes into the inner solar system. So those things happen. And it, but it didn't happen when life was established on the Earth. Do you ever entertain the idea that it's possible that we are the only intelligent life in the known universe? I tend to restrict myself to the galaxy. Right. So I do mm. think it's possible that at the moment there's one civilization in the Milky Way. And I think that's important, actually. And it goes back to what I was saying at the start about the uh, astronomy and cosmology being part of the framework within which you have to think. If you're looking for meaning or you're looking for how we should behave even politically you know the, that has a bearing to me i mean imagine that we're the only place where there is intelligence in this galaxy and how should we behave